LR1, Vintage Farm Guy, Happy Farm Friday, and welcome to System Test number 39 with the Simplex 4004 Fire Alarm Control Panel. So, let's get started with devices. For pulsation by the panel, I have my Simplex 2099-9754 Single Action T-Bar. Up here, I have a brand new alarm in my collection. Well, it's not brand new, it's used, but it's new to my collection. I have a Siemens UMMT MCS. Um, strobe on this is set on 110 candela, and the tone I have to set on is continuous horn. Um, and this also, this thing is on two wire operations, so strobe might not flash as much, so you're not gonna really be any arm silence for this alarm, so. But, yep, so anyway, that is the first initiating device and the first notification appliance on the system. Over here, I just still have the same smoke protector from last test, so this has it swapped out. And then over here, I just have my Simplex 4251-21. And then for the last device, I have my Wheelock RSS uh, 24MCW set on 30 Candela. So you'll be seeing this and the UMMT all the way over there for the system test. All right, so. That was pretty much an overview of the devices, as you can see. We just kind of have like a Siemens Wheelock theme on on Simplex, I believe. Yeah. <laughs> yep, nothing too special, so, yep. All right, so that's just pretty much an overview of the devices. Now, we can go on to the fun part. Of course, the activation of the system. Start off with the 2999 and the system will be on code 3. So, if you have epilepsy, do not watch this. As you see, that's still still going. And like I said, this is not really doing audible silence because this is on two wire operations. So, so now, all right, so that was code three. So now we can go ahead and reset the pulse station. And then we go ahead and do a system reset. All right, so like I said, give it a few seconds here. All right, so system has not been reset. So now we can go ahead and activate the smoke detector on the system and the system will be on March time. So I'll be right back. All right, system is now on March time. So now we go ahead, we'll grab our magnet and, act and we'll go ahead and activate the smoke detector. So here it goes. <laughs> All right, so that was pretty much March time. As you can see, we activated the smoke detector. 
So since it's not a pull station, we can just go ahead and reset the system. So. All right, let's give it a few seconds here. All right, so the system has now been reset. This is all back to normal. So now we can go ahead and activate the last device on the system. This is the 4251-21 and the system will be on continuous. So be right back. All right, so the system is now on continuous. So now we can go ahead and let's activate the last pull station or the last initiating device on the system, the 4251-21. This thing is so loud. <laughs> yeah. I think the spectrum already advanced is way louder than that, probably. Maybe the MT as well, so. Yep. Alright. Pulse station has now been reset. So now, go back to the panel and do a final system reset. Alright. Give it a few seconds here. Like I said. And, uh, boom, just like that. <laughs> All right, so, okay, so that pretty much wraps up for System Test 39. Yep, you know, see, we've got like the Siemens kind of wheel lock theme, as you could probably tell. Yep, pretty much all on Simplex, so, yep. All right, so next system test, it's not gonna include any horns. Um, next test we'll probably have something a little bit different, so, you know, there won't be any horns, horn strobes. It might sound similar to bells, but it's not going to be bells, so. What's going to be for next system test? Well, stay tuned for system test 40, because system test 40 is going to be kind of a quiet one, so. Yep. But, yeah, so, that pretty much wraps up for this video. If you all enjoyed this video, don't forget to like this video, drop a comment down below, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you all next week for the next Follow Friday. So, have a great day, everyone.